I tested eight new eyeshadow palettes this month, and these are the palettes that I loved and that I didn't love. ColourPop absolutely killed it this month. If you love color, you need to get this one. Great value. This is my favorite for neutrals. This one's okay, but you know what? It was still good. I got some gorgeous looks. Pamagrat's Star Wars collection honestly was done so lazily, but I do enjoy the formula of these shadows. This particular one, though, had a very boring color story, so it's not one I'm going to reach for all the time. The quality was good, though. And this color story was better, but it can apply patchy, so you got to be careful, but it's prettier. I don't know. This was a disappointment as a collection overall. This won't be everybody's cup of tea, but I thought it was gorgeous, very high quality, but it just depends. D do you like color or no? This is what I would call a dupe for $90 Tom Ford eyeshadows because I give that effortless eye look that's really smooth over the lid, very elegant. Hear me out, she might look boring, but this is one of Viseart's prettiest palettes, the highest of high quality. It looks 10 times more gorgeous on the eyelid.